Hi, let's understand the power control in 4G LTE. We are going to discuss about the power control mechanism in UNC uplink precisely because in downlink we have a dynamic power control system which can reduce and increase the power as per the requirement. But in uplink it is more precisely focused in 4G so as to reduce the interference in the uplink which overkills the overall efficiency in the radio interface. Now there are two different kind of power control. One is an open loop power control, another is a closed loop power control. Now as name signifies, the closed loop power control is the mechanism where there is a feedback coming from the another party which is the base station. So whenever user equipment is talking to the base station in the uplink, there could be different scenarios. One scenario we are picking up for open loop power control is when the UE is switched on first time and it needs to send the signal with the appropriate power so as to reach to the base station. It is possible that the power which is going from the base station to the user that is that is good enough but in the uplink it is not good enough to reach to the base station. Normally whenever the UE is powered on it sends the reference signal which is having a fixed power associated with it in the downlink. Now after that, once UE will get the reference signal, it decode it and then it measures the path loss between the base station and the user. And it depends upon how far the user is. If it is closer to the base station, in that case, the path loss would be less. But say in this case, we are considering an example where the user is lying somewhere at the cell edge and there the path loss is quite high. Now UE will figure out like what exactly the power it has to transmit depending upon its own ecosystem or depending upon the power setting algorithm which is inbuilt into the user equipment. Now this mechanism is pretty fast because there is no other feedback mechanism involved. Here the power will be controlled primarily by the path loss. On the other side we have a closed loop power control system which is widely used in the network and here in this case we have a mechanism include where the feedback coming from the base station to the user also comes into the picture so ue is going to the base station and base station is sensing that the receive power is not good enough and then there is a transmit power command going in the pdcch which tells that the power is less and we need to increase the power. The step size should be increased in this case. Now it will consider the target power, target SNR in that case, 